If you've been watching this channel for a while, you know that I really like seowriting.ai. It's a tool that I use for a lot of long form content generation for blogs, but I also like to use it for Amazon affiliate type posts. Today, what I wanna do is take you through a product review post. And you start off in seowriting.ai by clicking on the product button. It takes you to the page where you're going to begin writing your product review. But you always have to have a main keyword. That's typically something related to your product. In this case, what I'm going to do is this is my Osmo Action 4 camera by DJI. Really love this little camera for vlogging. And I've wanted to do a product review post on it for a while. That's going to be the topic of this particular post. The main keyword for this particular product review post is DJI Osmo Action 4 for vlogging. We need the Amazon product link. I'm going to go ahead and take that product link, grab it, and here, here's the camera in Amazon. It runs about $2.99. What it will do is it will go out, it will look for the Amazon product link that's affiliated with this particular item in Amazon, and it will just let you know that it's found the link and it verifies that link is there. The other thing that you can do if you want to do this is some advanced SEO. You can click the checkbox for SEO for the advanced tools. You can add additional keywords in here. You can put in your word count, the number of headings that you want, paragraphs, images. Now, typically images on a product review, you know, I'm going to shoot pictures of my camera myself and put those in. I really don't need any images. It would just be keywords that I would be interested in adding here. I've added some additional keywords here. Word count. I'm just going to put in 2000. I'm just going to leave the headings blank, paragraphs blank, images blank, content analysis. I want the main keyword in the meta title, the meta description, the H1 header, H2 header h3 headers. There's not going to be any images, so I'm not going to worry about the alt text. So I've done that. So the brief is complete. I'm going to hit save and continue. Now let's generate some titles. I don't like any of those. I'm going to generate some more. I'm going to go with this one, DJ, DJI Osmo Action 4 for vlogging review, standard combo. The only thing that I want to change here is I need those to be capitalized. That's good. So we're going to go next, generate some descriptions. I'm going to go with this one right here, capture every moment with the DJI Osmo Action 4. Go next. We're going to generate some headings. Now we've got our headings. Once we have that, we select the area. We let the AI write. And again, for the sake of time, I'm just going to go ahead and let the AI write this. I'd go through this and make sure that everything appeared factual. I've had this camera for a while. I'm pretty familiar with all the specifications. It's always a big advantage if you know the product that you're writing about. For example, operating system Android has nothing to do with this camera. I'm not sure where they, they picked this up. So I'm definitely going to pull this out. So it goes through functionality, battery life. But one section it has is what is not so great about this camera. I'm going to let the AI write it. I'll read it and see if I agree. But if I don't agree with it, I will write about some of the shortcomings of the camera because there are a few. So we've done that. We click next. And just remember, you're doing all of these things in order here. Brief, title, description, headings. We've done everything here. We've written it. Go to the product section. The product list, the product list has been added. Here it is. So that's nice. It's pulled in that particular picture of the Action 4. Now, I would add more detailed photos for the rest of the article. I wouldn't go just with this photo only, but it is a nice photo. Here we can go in and we can let the AI write a verdict, pros and cons, and we'll have to read what these are and determine whether it makes sense or not, like lackluster voice control. I think what it means is, you know, the mic the internal built-in mic isn't that great, which is true. The dated design with a smallish rear screen, not so sure I agree with that. But but my point is, you're the expert in your particular niche and the products that you're promoting uh, through your Amazon affiliate links. You just need to go through and make sure that everything sounds and looks the way that you'd want it to. Those are the specs. That's just a real brief list of specs. We click next. Now we're at the checker. 
And the checker is just its way of letting you know what the overall score for the article is. It says it's a 78. So words, 28%. Keywords were 34%. So 11 of 11 keywords were used. Content analysis, two of five. Not quite sure what they mean by that. So let's go ahead and take a look. The main keywords in the meta title, the meta description, but it's not in the H1 header, H2, or H3. But you'd want to go back in and add something like DJI Osmo Action 4 standard combo and then for blogging. And that way you're, you're getting your keywords into your H1, which is really important. For this particular header, I might put in how to use the DJI Osmo Action 4 and just add for vlogging. Notice the score is up to 82% now because we have the main keyword in the meta title description and the header it says not H1 header yet. So yeah, this is what we should have done. DJI Osmo Action 4 for vlogging, standard combo, 4K camera review. So now we're up to 88% on this little AI check here. We don't have anything using the keyword in an H3, probably not necessary, but that completes the article. So there you have it right here. I'd need to go through, I'd need to read through this and make sure uh, that everything was factually correct. I'd probably split this paragraph, give it a little white space here, but that's how you would use seowriting.ai to create uh, an Amazon affiliate product review. And what's really nice, gives you this really nice view on Amazon button and you're all set. Here's the pricing structure for seowriting.ai. You can, of course, write long form content with this tool. You can write Amazon roundup posts. You can do uh, product reviews like we just looked at. It can do a lot of different things for you. You can either purchase on a yearly basis or on a monthly basis. Just make sure you use my link and discount code. If you decide to make a purchase of seowriting.ai, you'll get 25% off. And you can go through and you can see by changing this little slider here, what it would cost for the various levels of SEO writing. And, and it's all dependent on the number of words per month that you have in your account. So I hope you found this seowriting.ai product review post tutorial useful. Make sure you like and subscribe. And until next time, take care.